guys, welcome to Math is Fun with Amma Joy, Math Heroes. For episode one, Al Khwarizmi, the father of algebra. Abu Jafar Muhammad IBN Musa Al Khwarizmi lived in Baghdad around 780 to 850 CE or AD. He was one of the first to write about algebra using words, not letters. Around 825, he wrote the book Hisab al Jabrub wal Mukabala, from which we get the word algebra, meaning restoration of broken parts. This book included many word problems, especially dealing with inheritance. Al Khwarizmi helped establish widespread use of Hindu Arabic numbers, which are one, two, three, and so on and so forth, which replaced Roman numerals which was common throughout Europe and the Middle East as a result of the spread of the Roman Empire. And so then, I, 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 V. The Hindu Arabic system was much easier to use when performing mathematical operations, since it is a base 10 system. Ever tried multiplying using Roman numerals? <laughs> this Islamic mathematician was also instrumental in encouraging the use of the number zero as a placeholder. For example, the zero in the number 105 indicates there are no multiples of 10 in this number. The zero is just separating the one four hundreds and the five four ones. The House of Wisdom, Baghdad. Al Khwarizmi was a scholar at the House of Wisdom in Baghdad. This group was interested in re engaging with the brilliant work of the ancient Greeks, which had been lost and almost forgotten about for centuries. Apart from translating the classic Greek text, they published their own research on algebra, geometry, and astronomy. The scholars weren't simply producing academic works. They were trying to solve the problems of the day involving lawsuits, trade, measurement, and inheritance. al Khwarizmi's Algebra The algebra presented in the book Hisab al-Jabri wal Mukabala used words for variables, so it was not as convenient as the algebra we use today. Algebra means completion and al mukabala means balancing. His aim was to solve linear or quadratic equations by removing negatives using a process of balancing both sides of an equation. This is the same as what we do in algebra today. From al Khwarizmi's name came the word algorithm. Thank you. Math is fun with Amma Joy.